You've got a problem. There's a big river to cross. So naturally, you decide to build a bridge. But wait, the bridge supports, called piers, will get in the way of ships passing underneath. What if you use fewer piers and make the bridge higher? You could hang the bridge deck from tall towers using cables. Congrats, you've just reinvented the suspension bridge. But there's still a problem. What happens if a really tall ship comes through? Even a high bridge might block its way. Sure, you could raise the whole bridge deck even more, but then you'd need super long approach ramps. That would take up a ton of land and cost cost way more to build. So, you have a genius idea. What if the bridge could lift up when a ship comes by, then lower back down after it passes? Like a giant drawbridge? But there's a catch. The bridge deck weighs thousands of tons. You can't just pull it up with ropes. It's way too heavy. Then you get smart. What if you balance the bridge with heavy counterweights, using the power of leverage? With this setup, lifting the bridge takes way less effort. But another problem pops up. When the two halves of the bridge lift, they're not connected in the middle anymore. They could pull on the towers unevenly and make everything unstable. No problem. You think ahead again. You add ropes between both sides to keep the bridge steady when it lifts. But wait, what about pedestrians? When the bridge deck rises, people can't cross. So you come up with a clever fix. You build a walkway above the moving deck, complete with stairs and a roof so people can keep walking no matter what. And just like that, congratulations, you've invented the famous London Bridge. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing videos.